Hi, in this lecture I am going to solve some more known verbal reasoning questions. These questions are basically analytical reasoning questions. Analytical reasoning questions. So, let's solve this question. In this question, find the number of triangles in the given figure. If you count if you start counting these triangles without any plan this question you know will become very difficult question but if you if you do it with you know proper steps it is a very easy question so first of all what you do is you label this diagram you label all the possible vertices like a b c d e f g h I J and to make this counting very very simple we need to follow these steps first of all you count all the triangles all the triangles that are single triangles all the single triangles or which are in simplest form of triangle for example this A H G and all those triangles like this 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 and this so let me write these triangles to make you understand otherwise you have counted all all these triangles like 1 2 3 4 5 6 these these are six triangles which are simple triangles but let me to simplify i will write these names also for you a h g a i g a i b and J F E C J E C E D. Obviously, you will not write these names. You just have to count these triangles, okay? But but to uh, to make you understand this question, I am writing these names also. So, how many total triangles of simplest form? Six triangles okay so the second step would be you count those triangles which are composed of two triangles count such triangles that are composed of composed of two triangles for example if you if you notice triangle abg abg it consists of AIG and AIB. Similarly, CFE is one such triangle, ACJ is one such triangle, EGI is one such triangle, and and that's it. One, two, three, four. So we have total four triangles which are composed of exactly two triangles so the next logical step would be to count the triangles that are composed of composed of three triangles a c e a g e and c F D. These three triangles are such triangles that consists of three triangles. So the number is also three. So step four. The next step would be to count the triangles which are composed of four triangles. And if you notice very carefully there is only one triangle a h e that consists of four triangles so there is only one such triangle let's count the number 6 from step 1 4 from step 2 three triangles that consists of three triangles and one triangle that consists of 
four triangles. So total triangles are six plus four plus three plus one that is fourteen triangles. So the answer choice would be D. Okay, you don't have to write these steps while you are you are performing this question in you know uh, in a competition. So uh, it will it will not take that much of time without writing these steps. So let's solve one more question and you will become comfortable with counting of triangles. Okay. This is also a very good question. So first thing we do is we will mark these vertices. For example, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L. So first thing we do is we count single triangles. Single triangles. Okay, and these triangles are A, B, C, C, E, F, J, F, K, I, J, L, G, H, I, and D, B, G. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So we have 6 single triangles. Okay, next step is to count triangles which which are composed of two triangles at least <coughs> and uh, if you notice carefully there are no such triangles zero so next step would be to count three triangles those triangles which consists of three triangles and one such triangle is triangle a h k okay this the, why a h k because it consists of a b c G H I and J F K. Similarly, another such triangle would be D E L. So, two such triangles, and that's it. There are no triangles which are which consists of more than three triangles. So, so the total number of triangles in this figure is six plus two eight triangles and the correct option would be option C. Thank you.